you hear a lot of toy hunters and retro collectors say that there's nothing good out there anymore, that uh, it's all been sent to Marketplace or sent to eBay or or you, you just find, don't find the good stuff. This haul, this haul proves that there is still good stuff out there. Okay, so story time. I answered an ad with a gentleman who had some Pokemon games for sale. Uh, make an offer. And uh, I asked how much he was after. Turns out someone had offered him uh, an amount that I was unwilling to pay at this point in time. So I said, thanks very much. Anyway, today after work, I got a message from him saying that person hasn't answered him back. He's open to offers. I sent what I'd be happy to pay. He was fine with it. So I went around his house. Rocked up, and he had a couple of Game Boys there. So I ended up getting, uh, I'll show some footage here of my Game Boy DMG, works perfectly. Uh, the Game Boy Color, again, works perfectly, as well as these games. All the Pokemon games, the saves work and look in really good condition. And then he said, oh, do you like Pokemon cards? I said, well, yeah, I mean, everyone likes Pokemon cards. He goes, oh, I reckon I've got some. Not, not the original series, but... Sort of like the second printing of the original series. I went, oh, oh, can I have a look? And he goes, yeah, sure. And he went in and got them. This is what he had. So out came this folder, opened it up straight away and excuse the, excuse the glare, look at this. These are the promo cards. I know they're not worth that much, but they're pretty cool. Uh, that one's a little bit damaged, but these are all second edition of the original base set. Oh, hello, Alakazam. Remember that card? Reverse Hollow of Alakazam, Reverse Hollow of Chansey, uh, Reverse Gyarados, Clefairy, Poliwhirl. Look at that. And then, oh, look, there's more Reverse Hollows. So we've got a Reverse Hollow Mewtwo, Nidoking, Ninetales, Raichu, Poliwrath, a Zapdos in there. And then we get into just the base set. Again, this is all, all of this is the second printing of the original series. I absolutely freaked out when he was showing me all this. Anyway, like for like, that's what we got. More of that, more of that. Yep, cool. But I hear you think there's no real big hitters in there. Uh, that's because the first thing I did when I came home is I took them out. So also in this collection, we had reverse hollow blastoise. Reverse Hollow Venusaur. Oh yeah, and another Reverse Hollow Venusaur. There was two in here. And then, you guys know what I'm going to pull up now. Granted, it's the second printing. Granted, it's not a shadowless. That's a $600 card. Needless to say... I was really freaking happy with the $100 I spent getting this. Yes, that's right. This whole set cost me $100. Absolutely amazing. I never thought I would own a full base set of the original series. And pff, wow, just wow. So that's a pretty good score, but I want to know what's your best score. Let me know in the comments. Hit me up uh, and let me know down below. Like, subscribe, and let us know what is the best retro score that you got so we can let everyone know they should all go out hunting. Actually, no, we don't want people going out hunting because then I won't get any more scores like this.